Hey everybody, Dory and I want to show you how to make a homestead quickie little meal. All right, so for some of you, you've seen my videos on making bread. This is a little baguette that I made yesterday. I've got homestead tomatoes from my greenhouse. I've got some homegrown oregano, and this is a homemade paneer. I've also got that cheese making video. So what I've done is I've just started to heat up some oil. I'm gonna throw in the garlic, just like that. And then I'm just gonna slice these tomatoes in half. And I'm not reducing them. I'm just kind of just blistering them a little bit on the heat. All right, good amount of salt. As you know, I don't measure anything. And I'm gonna throw in some of this oregano. All right, it's been a couple minutes. I'm just gonna flip them. Again, I'm not trying to get these into a paste. I still want some texture. I just wanna give them a little kiss of that heat. Some fresh ground black pepper. I mean, salt and pepper with tomatoes. You can't go wrong. All right, you see the juices bubbling out of this one? I think they're pretty much done. I'm gonna let them rest. You might be wondering why I use so much oil. Well, here's the answer. You want that to soak up all that flavor, all that oil. I'm going to turn the heat up a little bit. Basically give it just a little, little toastiness on each side. Yeah. All right, all that oil soaked in there. Nice, warm. And while they're warm, I'm gonna go ahead and break up some of the simple little cheese on there. Basically, if you're wondering, this is a very loose paneer. So I've got a video on paneer cheese making, but instead of pressing it, I left it nice and gooey, because what I'm after is almost like a ricotta, or like a very, very uh, mild goat cheese type of effect here. So what do you think? Maybe a little more? Oh yeah. All right, we take our softened tomatoes. Oh, just go ahead and make a mess. That's what's good. All right, so we're gonna load all of our tomatoes onto here. All right, I diced up that garlic. It's still hot. Caramelize it a little bit. Let's gonna do is just scrape those goodies. All right, I think it's ready to eat. All right, let's give this a try. I'm just gonna make a big mess. Mmm. Mmm. Really good. Really fresh.